Presenting the Rose Parade banner are Boy Scouts from Troop 408. We thank Carson Coberman and Oliver Duquette for their assistance. Yeah. All right, please rise as the Roselle American Legion post 1084 is proud to kick off this year's parade. Today's honor guard is escorted by Post Commander Ty Cobb and Sergeant at Arms Tim O'Neill. Ty also represents the Roselle Chamber as a service award recipient. Post 1084 actively supports our veterans for over 65 years through community service activities. Up next, we have the Village of Roselle, celebrated its centennial anniversary in 2022 and was named top pick for Beer Town and Live in 2023 and 24. Village officials and staff are riding on this year's float. Hi, Anita. There's Lee Trejo, Wayne Donkey, Mayor Pileski. Good job. Remember to throw it down in the down in the gutter, guys. Not at the kids. Whoa! Brian, thank you. The Roselle Fire Department is celebrating its 116 year of proudly serving residents and visitors to Roselle, Medina, and parts of unincorporated Chamber. And here comes the Roselle Police Department, the DuPage County Sheriff here today. Oh, and our business person of the year, Bellagio's Restaurant, welcoming. Hello, congratulations. Well deserved. They have the best grilled calamari. You got to go have that. Bellagio's Restaurant. And Bellagio's Restaurant, yes. For 30 years, Hugo, Gilberto, and Edgar have made their customers feel like family. Here comes a trolley filled with staff and third generation family members from Salerno, Rosedale, and Galewood Chapel. Say hi to George and Frank Salerno, their families, and Cindy and Ava and other staff from Salerno. Chicago Garda Pipes and Drums. of American Legion Post 1084, Sons of the American Legion Squadron 1084, and the Women's Auxiliary. Be sure to visit the Post on Friday evenings for Roselle Cruise Nights through the end of September. Lots of patriotism there. Great float, you guys. Looks beautiful. American Legion. 
here comes the 2024 Rose Ambassador Scholarship Court. This program offers high school students an opportunity to compete for college scholarships to help further their education. Congratulations, the 2024 Rose Ambassador Court. All right, next in line, Blood Brothers Disposal and Recycling. They are the village's exclusive residential and commercial waste and recycling provider since 2020. They're a proud family-owned and operated waste removal company with a tradition since 1930. Blood Brothers thanks the Roselle Chamber of Commerce and the Village of Roselle for hosting the annual Rose Parade. Next up, we have the Knights of Columbus, Pope John Council, 5732, from St. Walter Parish in Roselle. Thanks to the Roselle community for its strong support for over 50 years. The Knights of Columbus perform acts of charity, unity, fraternity, and patriotism while supporting our priests and Catholic ideals. We have the Lake Park Marching Band. It's a long and proud tradition of excellence. They have been finalists, class champions, and grand champions at numerous state, regional, and national events over the past three decades. Lake Park Marching Band. Next up, we have the Roselle History Museum. It was established in 1980 and provides tours of Roselle memorabilia. Established in 1978, Cub Scout Pack 458 includes boys and girls in kindergarten through fifth grade. Their motto, do your best, is taught in the scouting program as well as in life. Established in 1987, Stan's service station has offered the community help with all their automotive and diesel repair needs for the last 37 years.
Roselle's sister cities, established in 2001, has a sister city in Bachnia, Poland, and has two active committees seeking a sister city in Germany and Italy. Have the Sister Cities Italian Committee. Itasca Bank and Trust is proud to sponsor the Jesse White Tumblers. Staff members Deirdre Johnson, Osman, and Vicenta Castro of Campo are pleased to represent the bank in today's parade. Itasca Bank has been serving area residents for over 75 years. They take pride in providing true community banking services. The Jesse White Tumbling Team was created in 1959 to provide a positive alternative for inner city youth. Since then, over 20,000 youth have been benefited from the program, which provides an athletic, cultural en uh, enchantment, enrichment, and educational opportunity to team members. Try this at home. <laughs> Amazing job. Thank you, Jesse White Tumblers. Great job, guys. Great job. Here comes one of our favorite, Tony Spavone at Spavone's Restaurante on Lake Street in Bloomingdale. Tony entertains his guests nightly at the restaurant and performs professionally as well as at many community uh, events to raise funds for the elderly, veterans, local schools, and many other charities. Tony is the Chamber's 2003 Business Person of the Year, and we thank him for participating in this year's Rose Parade. The Medina Shriners Aviators Unit was established in 1967 with the purpose of flying children and their parents to various Shriners hospitals. Today, the Aviators Unit mainly raises money for the transportation fund, while many members are pilots and own their own plane. Uh, neither is a requirement to be a member. The Roselle Park District uh, operates and manages over 158 acres of land, 18 parks, and offers many recreational programs for all ages. They serve the needs of their patrons and improve the quality of life in our community through the provision of parks, recreation, and the, and the preservation of open space.
team. A cheer for Rick Aspen, also known as the captain. Since 2008, Rick Aspen has been entertaining people of all ages at private and corporate events. He is the captain. Lat 43 BMX team has been competing and performing for the past 20 years. These BMX tricks take endless years of practice and dedication. Again, do not try this at home. They always promote bike safety and always wear helmets during their performances. Right behind the flat 43 BMX is the Cornerstone Faith Community Church. For over 140 years, Cornerstone Faith Community Church has, began, has been meeting the spiritual needs of our community. They're located at Bloomingdale Road and Franklin Street in Bloomingdale. You guys sound great. Established in 1965, the Medina Park District serves over 9,500 residents in the Medina, Roselle, and Itasca communities. They manage and maintain 105, more than 105 acres and offer programs and events for all ages. Lights, camera, dancing, or putting on a show. Lots of practice, hours and hours of practice, dedication. Lights, camera, dancing, dance studio is located at 688 East Irving Park Road in Roselle. Their facility offers classes for one-year-old through adults. They are dedicated to providing a well-rounded, encouraging, challenging, energetic, and fun atmosphere. Go to LightsCameraDancing.com for current schedules or just stop by the studio. You guys look great. Hey, Stacy. Stacy is our owner of Lights Camera Dancing. All right, established in 2010, Dr. Dogs have served the best Chicago-style hot dogs, burgers, and sandwiches in Roselle. Check out their wide variety menu and catering that is available at 253 East Irving Park Road. The Medina Patrol was founded in 1886 and is the first parade unit in Trindom. Since 2015, it now performs as a Segway unit. And here they are. Looking good, the Medina Patrol. All right, coming up is our returning best business float from last year. Briscoe Signs won the Mayor's Award for best business, and it looks like he's pulling out the stops to win it again. They've got another homemade float celebrating their 51st year in Roselle. Briscoe Signs. Long time in the community. Strong community partners. Thank you, Briscoe Signs. Pollyanna Brewing and Distilling at 245 East Main Street has an inviting tap room and fantastic outdoor beer garden, serving award-winning craft beer and craft cocktails. Pollyanna hosts various community events 
as well as weekly trivia nights, live music, food trucks, and they are available for private rooms. With the motto of We Serve, please welcome the Roselle Lions. Since 1934, they've led programs for sight, hearing, and speech conservation, plus drives, drives for food, blood draws, coats, and so much more. Roselle Lions Club. Baseball, independent professional baseball team located in Schaumburg. Four-time Frontier League champions and have the highest attendance in the league. Coop, their mascot, is a prairie chicken and can't wait to see everybody at Wintress Field. All right, coming up next is the Roselle Arts and Culture Foundation. They are the community group winner of the Mayor's Award last year, and I think they have outdone themselves. Look at this float, ladies and gentlemen. I can see the flames. I can see the rings. I can see the hat. The, what the, was that? There we go. They all got their hats on. As Americans celebrate our Olympians in Paris this summer, Roselle Arts and Culture Foundation is capturing the gold by honoring our first responders with a new brick landscape and beautiful public work of art. Show your support by ordering a family or business brick before, before July 15th at RoselleArtsCulture.com. Great job on that flow, Roselle Arts and Culture. That is beautiful. Roselle School District 12 proudly presents the Roselle District 12 Marching Band under the direction of Marcus Cash. The marching band consists of fourth through eighth grade students. the Medina Flying Carpets, who have been entertaining throughout great crowds for 55 years. Can they really fly? Let's go. Give them a hand. Yes. Medina Flying Carpets. Next up we have Andy Linder. He holds five world records in the sport of foot bag which is also known as Hacky Sack. Among his records is the world's record for kicking a foot bag the fastest with 1,019 kicks in five minutes. The DeGrado Insurance Agency has been in Roselle for five years, helping the community receive the insurance that best fits their needs. Stop by their office for a quick conversation with these guys to realize you are much more than a number. They're located in downtown Roselle off Roselle Road. Established in 1998, School of Rock now boasts over 300 locations worldwide. School of Rock Schomburg is in its seventh year of teaching their amazing students who range from three 
through adults. The School of Rock House Band is proud to present their school today. participated in parades for over 40 years with a mission to support disabled children at Shriners Hospital. The Relay for Life for the American Cancer Society is a community event to sponsor or to honor survivors and remember those who lost their battle with cancer. The Relay will be held on August 23rd from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. at Turner Park with Luminaria uh, Ceremony at 9 p.m. Metro Paramedics Superior Ambulance has been providing EMS service to the Chicagoland area and suburbs since 1959. They have three antique ambulances, including a 1940 Packard, a 1956 Cadillac, and this 1970 Cadillac. Established in 1940, Roselle Public Library has 32 staff members to serve the village with new and exciting books, electronic media, and library programs. Sign up to participate in their summer reading and challenge for the kids, teens, and adults. These electric motorized picnic coolers are driven by members of the DuPage Shrine Club from Medina Shrine Center in Addison. They cruise so children can walk. We love Aunt Tina's Soundbites. Aunt Tina's Soundbites is Roselle's hometown food truck established in 2022, specializing in Southern comfort food. Their mission is to bring unity to our community through good food and music. New this year is their restaurant, Aunt Tina's Kitchen, opening in Elmhurst later this month. Please continue to support this local couple as they grow and expand their business. The Medina Shrine Police Unit is led by Chief Rich Richard Shack. They are one of the oldest shrine units at Medina. MSBO is a local youth organization that has been operating in the area since 1958. They are 30 teams strong with over 400 participants and volunteers. Montrose Market is part of the Montrose Deli chain. They're happy to call Roselle home for the last two years. 
Montrose Market is the number one place for daily shopping as well as catering for all occasions. Love Montrose Market, and on Wednesdays they offer 15% off. It's a great day, to, a great place to shop. Coming down the road here is the VW Vocho Club of Chicago, which was founded in 2015. They are a Hispanic community of 70 members from various countries. Every member loves Volkswagen Beetles and buses with their oldest car being from 1954. Those are some amazing bugs. Back in the day, everybody drove one. Back in the day. Yep. <laughs> Got the Olympic rings on top of the cars. Got the podium for first, second, and third place on top of one of the cars. Very clever. Very clever. VW Vocho Club of Chicago. Oh, here comes the buses. These buses were used for living in, sleeping in. I'm from California, and let me tell you, they were everywhere. Everybody had a V-Dub, had a bug or a bus. Got the Olympic rings. Got the flames, got some balloons. Looking good, you guys. Beautiful. Established in 2020 is the Relief Performing Arts, which provides professional dance instruction for youth and adults in a safe and uplifting environment. Looking good, Relief Performing Arts. Thanks for being here today. Medina Shriners Fire Unit participates in parades in support of the Shriners Children Hospital, which provides specialized care to children with orthopedic conditions, burns, spinal cord injuries, and cleft palate. Thank you, Medina Shriners. Very generous organization. All right, wrapping up our parade is the Roselle Food Pantry. Executive Director Vicki Johnson supports and leads the Roselle Food Pantry, which provides food, uh, helps with food insecurity for residents of Roselle, Schomburg, Medina, Bloomingdale. And we thank the Village of Roselle Public Works for their assistance in staging today's parade. We couldn't do it without you guys.